Okay, everybody, this time I'm doing a video on how to do um, a screen share on a Chromebook using Zoom. So you'll see I'm already live in Zoom here. Now the key piece of this is you can either share your desktop right here, which shares your whole desktop, and when you click share, it minimizes everything, and then you're sharing all this stuff. You see the whole thing's being shared. So everything that's here and up, it's being shared. So if I click between stuff, they're seeing all that stuff. Or I can go out of here, let's stop share. Or let's say I wanna share specific programs. Now here's the crucial piece about this. To share the different programs, you need them to be open and you need them to be uh, maximized. You can't do it if it's minimized. A lot of times it doesn't work. So they're maximized. I've got Wonderlist maximized and Google Notes. I've got Chrome, all those are open and maximized. You go back to here and you click share on the Chromebook and then application. Click application and it lets you choose which one. And look at this, how easy it is. So when you do this, let's say I want to do Wonderlist, which doesn't work anymore, but at least, you know, show. So it says you're sharing your screen. Now here's the thing. It's only sharing Wonderlist, which is right here, instead of the whole thing. So now Wonderlist is being shared. Stop share. Now let's say I want to share, what else is maximized? Google Keep. I want to share that. So now I'm sharing Google Keep with everyone, okay? So that's the way you share what's up. What I usually like to do is I like to make sure that whatever I've got up on my desktop is what I wanna share anyway, but that's how easy it is. That's how you do it in Chrome. And if you don't have access to this, um, you may need to upgrade your account, but that's, you know, it's gonna be 15 bucks or something like that. But I think everyone has access to it. If you are not the host, you may not be able to share your desktop or your applications. So you may have to request from the person that is the host to make you a co-host to do it, which they can do by managing participants. And inside of here, they can manage and choose to promote someone to host with them or co-host, all right? So that's it, it's that easy. It really doesn't take a lot to share. You just click share and then you choose whether it's desktop or application. Desktop's the easiest. And if you choose application, just make sure it's not only open, but maximized, okay? That's it, guys, enjoy. Okay, so before I let you go, don't forget a couple things. Number one, number one, Make sure to click like if this helps you and put notes in the comments, put um, whether it helped you or not, or if you got any questions, put it in the comments. We'll answer it or do another tutorial if you got a request. And then subscribe to our channel. You guys, thanks for being with Nerd Cheek. Boom.